here we've been in the process of putting in some flooring uh, into the shop. Really doing a lot of stuff to get everything cleaned up and tidied up. Um, just there's so much clutter, but that's what I was having to deal with. The fact that I was working while I moved from one shop to another, and so um, I've added some storage and uh, some secure storage as well. Uh, that's going to allow me to get a lot of the clutter picked up, cleaned up, and in the process of reorganizing. And so uh, you'll see some some things changing for the better around here, but this is just in process, uh, putting this flooring in. And what I've done is I've just gone with this uh, fairly inexpensive foam flooring sections. Um, you can see the difference in the coloring right here. Um, the one that you're looking at that's got the ladder on it there, that one is uh, an older one that I had, and you can see over here, you see that one's kind of trampled down. Um, this flooring does real well, except for if you've got a piece like that one where it's just uh, the edge, um, the edges will get trampled down unless you have the, uh, unless you run these edge trim pieces on it. Um, and so what I'm doing is I'm putting new flooring in and I'm doing it right. I'm covering the whole thing and then in the high traffic areas or like over at my grind area um i'll get over here to the grind area here i'm using old flooring there the grind and blast and that way i'm not just you know I, the places the areas where i know i'm gonna have hot stuff go down on it and things like that that way i know that i've got older stuff and i can double up in the areas where I stand, I'll be able to take these old sections as I replace them and use them to add a little bit more padding either underneath the new stuff or on top, most likely on top. Um, so a lot of good uses for it. Uh, these things are running, I think Costco had them at right at 15 bucks for uh, a package and it's eight pieces for um, I think it was eight pieces. Let's see here. It was, and it's micro band, so that's good. Two by two pieces, interlocking tiles, eight, eight of them, yeah. Eight of them, and one package covers 32 square feet. So, for like 15 bucks, you get 32 square feet of coverage and I've been using this stuff uh, not the microband stuff but the other stuff you can see there's a few differences in some of the panels uh, but I've already been using it for a good long time and uh, I I liked it enough just a little bit that I was using already to go ahead and invest the extra money in covering the entire floor in it I looked into other options and I like this the best because like take for instance over here in the grind area or if I'm welding or something if I know I'm going to be doing a lot of welding one day or one week I can just pull up a section so I, I don't have to worry about you know spatter and have to worry about catching it on fire and all that stuff um, I've not had it catch on fire yet uh, I've had some hot stuff hit it while grinding and I've had it melt but I've not had any flame ups or anything like that now I know it would burn uh, but what I'm saying is with it being modular like this I can pull up the areas if I know I'm going to be doing some heat stuff or whatever I just need a concrete floor um, I can pull those areas up I can also repair sections that uh, have are worn out or damaged It'll be very easy uh, as I change the shop around uh, I can have the flexibility to move these and they're small they stack uh, and the other thing is whenever I have classes, this area right here, my toolboxes, my, my press, those get moved over against there. And then this becomes a teaching desk. Well, we're, we're actually going to have a monitor back here. 
and uh, then out here will be chairs and rows of chairs so that's what's going on there This is of the M1 carbines. The one on the bottom is a universal replica carbine, 30 caliber. You can see the difference there in the charging handle area. That's the main noticeable difference. And you'll notice the stock and everything is very shiny. That is uh, a result of the frog lube application and process. This original Korean era, it has not had the frog loop process done to it yet. I'll post a video showing it afterwards.